Hey guys, welcome back to Burns' Math Club. Today's topic is how to solve unit rate word problems. Rate um, is the ratio of two quantities which are measured in different units. Unit rate is the ratio of two quantities with the denominator 1. Examples of rate could be a car completes 20 miles in 30 minutes. I can represent this as a fraction, which is a which is one way to write the ratio. Uh, I could I represent this as twenty over thirty. Now another example could be Tim runs hundred meters in two minutes. I can also represent this as a fraction, uh, such as hundred over two. So as you can see, the, uh, these are ratios with, uh, with two quantities which are measured in different units such as miles or minutes or meters. Now unit rate. Examples of unit rate could be a cheetah uh, uh, completes 7 miles per hour. Okay, I can um, represent that as, as a fraction such as 7 over 1. So the denominator is 1. Another example could be a machine digs holes of 50 feet underground per hour. I can also represent this as a fraction of 50 over 1. So 1 is going to be a denominator whenever we are representing linear rates as fractions. Okay, now let's do a word problem. So now we have the word problem. It says, Josh is filling up a water aquarium for fish. If he fills 3 gallons of water in 15 minutes, then how much time will it take him to fill up a 12 gallon aquarium? Okay, so they're telling us that he can fill up 3 gallons of water in 15 minutes. So that's going to be our rate. I'm sorry. Let's reposition this. So that's going to be our rate which is 15 minutes um, let's say, um, in, fi in 15 minutes he can fill up 3 gallons and now the question is asking us how much time uh, it will it take to him to fill up a 12 gallon aquarium which we, we don't know so we're going to find that out and to do that we must find the unit rate and then multiply it by 12 so since we know the rate, which is 15 minutes, it takes him to fill up 3 gallons, we can find the unit rate. To do so, first we have to make um, this into a fraction. So 15 minutes uh, for 3 gallons can be represented as 15 over 3. Now the other, uh, the unit rate fraction is going to be re um, represented with the denominator of 1. But we don't know the unit rate, that's why we can represent it as a variable such as a. Now we cross multiply. So I'm going to multiply 3 by A and then I'm going to multiply 5, 15 by 1. When I multiply 3 by A, I get 3A. And then when I multiply 15 by 1, I get 15. Now we can see that we are going to solve for the variable which is a so since we're multiplying 3 by a we're going to use the inverse operation that means you're going to divide by 3 on both sides so when you do so 3 and 3 cancel each other out and we're left with a is equal to and then 15 divided by 3 gives us 5 so our unit rate is 5 minutes per gallon okay so it takes him five minutes to fill up one gallon okay so now all we have to do is you have to multiply 12 by 5 since we know that it takes him um five minutes per gallon so how, how many how much time will it take him for 12 gallons so now we multiply 12 by 5 one then uh, if we do that we get 60 so that means it will take him 60 minutes or 60 minutes is also equal to one hour. So it'll take him one hour to fill up a tank of 12 gallons. This is our answer. 
So this is how you solve unit rate word problems. Thank you for watching this video and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.